hello everyone and welcome back to my channel y'all welcome back to gemini and Priscilla. we're gonna do a reading for the sign of gemini if you are new here welcome welcome if you're returning welcome back welcome back welcome back a hey, welcome back welcome back welcome back to my channel any negative energy is being sent to me or my platform will be returned to the original sender as well as any positive energy being sent to me i will also be returning that energy to you as well i pray that you have overall wealth health abundance prosperity support okay i pray that any blockages that may be in your path right now are removed okay and i also pray that whatever healing you may need is restored okay whatever ailment all right so gemini i'm getting something about angel number 222 okay so there could be some type of balance being restored to your life there could also be something about you needing to find balance okay maybe you're doing too much of something okay or too little of something something needs to be balanced out here okay so that you can receive harmony spiritual alignment and peace all right this could be something you need to balance out in your love life okay your career your finances all right so we're gonna see what that's about i'm also getting something about your sacral there's something about your sacral um chakra here which represents the color on orange orange <laughs> orange we have it in the background it is located below your navel it represents your creativity and your sexual energy okay um you may be so how you know something's out of balance so that two 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 right that i'm getting your sacral could be out of balance so you guys may want to meditate on that get that back into alignment these are just some attributes that you would pick up on to know that you may be out of balance with your sacral. Lack or repressed creativity, sexual dysfunction, withheld intimacy, and emotional isolation. It's your second chakra. So some of you guys, you may want to get to work on that. All right. If you are watching from YouTube, you're only going to get the first 10 minutes of this reading. If you're watching from TikTok, you're only going to get the first five minutes of this reading. Okay. My content will only be available on Discord and or Patreon. The link will be in the description box below. I only have two membership options. I have a monthly membership option as well as an annual membership option. The annual membership is 50% off all year long. Well, it will forever be 50% off, actually. I'm never going to change that. <laughs> all right, so let's see what's happening. All right, we have a... You could have Chinese Zodiac of the Pig, all right? You could be very thoughtful and responsible. You could also have, like, some type of high intelligence as well. Maybe people have already complimented you on your... Um, maybe you think outside of the box or... Um, you could have been someone that leveled up in school very quickly or you had to you were able to skip grade levels or something like that. You're very intelligent, okay? There could be like some type of abundance. Yeah, fortune. Something about um, abundance. Hmm. You could like really be drawn to the color gold, blue, gray, brown, or yellow. This reading is definitely for you. We have adventurine, fortune. Chance is the first step you take. Luck is what comes after. Okay. So something about chance, something about fortune, something about abundance. So... Maybe you're going to think something is going to happen by chance, Gemini, but it's not. Something is in a, you're, so that's, that may be why Spirit wants you to get something in alignment, especially when it comes to your chakras, because there could be like some type of fortune that's lined up and ready for you, but you have to also be ready for it. 
by being in alignment, okay? Two, two, two. Yeah, this is like spirit wants you to have something. They think you are a spirit or your ancestors feel like you're very like, responsible for whatever this is. Uh, this could be like some type of new responsibility as well. Something could be changing with your um, schedule or your routine. All right, what's this? What's happening for Gemini? 12th house. Okay, Pisces. Yeah, this is a secret. This is something that, um, this may shock you, whatever this is. It, it's definitely going to change something about, like, your routine, about whatever you do. Like, let's say you get up every day at 7, blah, 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 blah. Then you're out of the house by 9. Like, something shifts here. Something changes, but it's it's for the better. You could have Pisces highly aspected. It says karma, secrets, hidden, reconnection, mystical power, charity, uh, surrender, psychic, return, accident, intuition, discovery, illusion, punishment, defeat. Okay. Hmm. So there's something here about a prediction. Maybe you predicted something. Or Gemini, if you've been sacrificing yourself, okay, maybe you just always knew, maybe you have been sacrificing something that you really wanted or something that you really want, but you've always known that something was just going to work itself out, okay? This is somebody that's what's being led by faith. There's something about your faith paying off in a really big way. Whatever the faith you had because you had to, let's say, sacrifice something, okay? Whatever that is, that's paying off. All right. There could also be something about karma. Okay. This could just be your dharma paying out to you. Like your good karma is paying out to you finally um, in September. Okay. Yeah, because we're heading into Libra season. So something could be happening right now in Virgo season, but... Or something could be being lined up for you in the 5D right now in Virgo season, but you won't actually get it until Libra season. Some type of justice, okay? A return on good karma, okay? Something about your intuition as well. Um, we have Unikite, trust. The best way to find out if you can trust somebody is to trust them. <laughs> All right, so maybe somebody was trying to get people to not trust you or something like that. They were Somebody could have been trying to make it seem like you're too secretive. You need to be investigated. You're not to be trusted or something like that. The best way to find out if you can trust somebody is to trust them. Hmm. Also, Gemini, you're going to need to trust somebody. Maybe you usually don't trust people in general. Something is changing in your life. Like, whatever is happening, it's like your routine changes. It could be someone coming into your life. God is wanting you to trust whoever this is, okay? Although people have proven you, to you in the past why people should not be trusted, there's something here about your faith and trust, okay? Something's changing with... um. Maybe somebody's coming in to test you, all right? Because you don't trust people. So whoever this is, it's like tr it, it's testing your intuition, whoever this is, okay? We have emerald growth. And the day came when the risk to remain tight in the bud was more painful than to risk it to... A little bit of that. And the day came when the risk to remain tight in a bud was more painful than the risk it took to blossom. Yeah, so you can't stay where you are. It's too painful. So, Gemini, let me tell you, this is going to be, this could definitely have something to do with growing pains. It could. But also, something has to do with expansion. It's going to be painful, whatever this is. This could even be like childbirth or something like that. But once it's released, whatever this is, once it's released, it's going to feel so much better. So maybe some type of secret is going to come out. 
and it's going to force some type of new shift to happen in your life. It's going to it's going to create and promote growth, but the secret may be painful. You get what I'm saying? This is definitely some type of transformation. We have um Chiastolite, unwavering tenacity, temper us in fire and we grow stronger. When we suffer, we survive. Or this just have been your life. You've been through some of you guys, you've already been through this. There's already there's there has already been a secret that came out about you. There there has always there have already been some type of like something that was secretive about you or maybe somebody was making something up about you where people were turning their back